I don't believe flea allergy causes otitis externa. I think these dogs are subclinical atopics, whether they're food or environmental. And flea allergy pushes them over threshold. Because you've seen, haven't you seen dogs where they certainly have signs of flea allergy, posterior one-third, maybe they have fleas on them, but maybe they're also licking their legs or chewing their feet, and you treat the flea allergy and they stop chewing their feet or licking their legs. Have you guys seen that? And those dogs aren't licking their legs because they're flea allergic. They're doing it because they're subclinical atopics that exceed threshold once you add fleas. And what's really neat about that theory is since they're subclinical, you can't prove I'm wrong. So... <laughs> 